What's up, y'all? It's Didi Conway. And if you haven't watched my last video, stop what you're doing right now and go click that link in the right corner. And then come back to this video. Cornstarch Crusaders, it's your turn. I'm smoking grits and selling chickens, call that painted living. It's Gucci. Living's on the chain with the meat cuts. Living's on the chain. First off, if you like this movie, you probably a white dude that most certainly at least thought about going to the school and airing that bitch out one time. I said pull that trigger now! Working jobs we hate, so we can buy shit we don't need. What in the fuck is you two niggas doing here? Naggers. Would have been the one time it's acceptable to tell them. We don't like your kind around here. If I did have a tumor, I'd name it Marla. <laughs> what did you say, nigga? My nigga, what in the fuck? All these quotes, burr freaky ass narration, it pissed me off. This whole movie and the bullshit narrative that comes with it pissed me off. Hey, we'd all be millionaires and movie gods and rock stars, but we won't. We're very, very pissed off. Yup. So start a fight club, glorify violence, because you realize society wasn't how it was presented to you. Stop being such a pussy, okay, pal? This shit created a bunch of school shooting ranch raccoons that wasn't getting coochie, so they formed a fight club where they can fuck with Naruto running and Pokemon cars. White power! Moving on to more vanilla culture. At number four, Mission Impossible, the franchise. Let's do it, move on! This whole fucking franchise is just Tom Cruise sitting down, looking in the mirror, asking himself, damn, how can I one-up myself for the next movie? Are you not Sergei? Oh! Hey, I saw one and two, and I give y'all that for sure. Like, them, them two good ones. But everything after this, motherfuckers just ass juice. It's the same fucking movie over and over. Just like Fast and the Furious franchise. Y'all had that movie. And y'all decided to take that hoe to the moon. And y'all did the same thing with this one. Moon, space, whatever. Y'all don't love this shit for the acting. You like it for the artistry that comes with the action scenes. White power! Ooh, this shit glorified ass. Coming out. Did you die? Shut up, bitch. Number three, the Rocky franchise. Hello, Rocky. Oh, do you find me sexy? Oh. I'm like, no, God. No, God, please, no, no, no. Like I said, glorified ass. The long performance as Rocky is trash. And if you ever get hurt. And you feel that you're going down. This little angel is going to whisper in your ear. Fight back, nigga! Fight back, nigga! Fight back! Y'all only love this shit for the underdog story. Stallone acting is terrible, bro. He act like he wear a fucking helmet. I want to be in the Special Olympics. The franchise peak at the first movie. Everyone after, awful. Because you can't win, Rock! This guy will kill you to death inside of three rounds! You're crazy. 200 can whoop ass! Rocky was an ass fighter, and how he fought would get his ass whooped, Mortal Kombat style. Oh, wow! Fatality. Wow! Basically, this nigga had a lot of heart and was looking at his stream being body ass wife to give him all the motivation. You can't win! Then y'all had the nerve. To basically use Rocky IV as a fucking propaganda film against the Soviets, bro. Hey, if we being real, Rocky was supposed to get his weak ass whooped, bro. Like, he was supposed to get knocked the fuck out, but they let <laughs> they let Apollo <laughs> take the L, get his ass put in a pack. I really miss my nigga. White power. And number two, Elf. Coming to town. Oh my God. If y'all seen a grown ass white man doing a good amount of this shit in public. Y'all would look at bro crazy as hell. That's exactly where I came from. Santa must have called you. What the fuck? I never thought this shit was funny. It just seemed like one big ass, mentally unstable white dude screaming about Santa. Coming to town. Shut up, bitch. If he hasn't figured out he's a human by now, I don't think he ever will. Man, come on, bro. Your big ass just realized you human? Fuck out of here. 
Y'all love this for the nostalgia, bro. I love Will for real. And never fuck with Elf, though. Genuinely didn't laugh not one time watching this shit. And motherfuckers used to scream at the top of their lungs to watch this. This shit ass. White power! Man, number one, y'all need to throw this bitch in a dumpster, the notebook. Say it with me. Glorified ass. Motherfuckers said for years this shit was, you know, romantic. This shit is toxic as hell. It's a romantic story for toxic motherfuckers. Like, that's it. Look at I'm about to go in. This nigga Noah is a stalker, and y'all cool with it. She only told her fiancé she need to clear her head because she was finna go fuck Noah. This whole movie is not as good as portrayed. I question everyone, especially women, that told me that this motherfucker was good. Like, it's over the years, I questioned all y'all. It wasn't good. Y'all was just some toxic thoughts. Thank y'all for coming. White power!